A new bylaw spells a partial victory for animal lovers in Surrey. It leaves dog owners thinking twice before leaving their pets tied up. Greg Harper is live in Surrey this morning with more on that. Greg. Good morning, Kyle. Yeah, here in Tynehead Park here in uh, Surrey and off-leash area behind us, uh, where we are hoping to get some reaction from uh, some dog owners uh, this morning to what's taking place here in Surrey. And that's an amendment uh, to a bylaw. Uh, City Council has uh, banned uh, tethering dogs for more than four hours in a day. So this means now that uh, dog owners or people who are responsible uh, for the dog aren't allowed to tie the dog up for uh, more than four hours. If they do, they will be ticketed uh, and fined mind or could be. The city considered an outright ban on tethering, but didn't think that would be realistic. And animal advocates actually wouldn't have minded that. We don't see how it is actually possible to be enforced. Um, it, require, it would require that animal control officers be on a, on, in visual range of a dog that's on a chain and watch that dog for a period of four hours um, to determine that it's been on the chain for that length of time before being able to cite the owners. Um, now, I don't, can't imagine that anyone's going to be doing that. So Surrey joins 16 other municipalities that have some sort of tethering ban in place, and it's a bit stricter in other uh, jurisdictions. In Burnaby, for example, uh, you're not allowed to tie your dog up for more than one hour a day, and there's a complete ban on it in Lions Bay and in Newestminster as well.